I've spent a lot of time exploring the Garrow Peninsula, from the many castles, caves, the geology of the landscape, ghost stories, folklore tales, and so much more. But I've spent very little time on North Gower, and I thought, what better place to start than the brilliant Whitford Lighthouse. This Grade II listed lighthouse is one of a kind, found on the northwestern tip of the Gower Peninsula, leading out along the edge of the Lucher Estuary. This lighthouse is particularly unique because it is the last remaining cast iron lighthouse found on the British Isles. It was built in 1865 to reveal the location of Whitford Point and to ward off ships of its dangerous sandbanks. It actually replaced an earlier wooden structure from 1854. The last time the lighthouse was lit was during the 1920s, although it did have a brief comeback in the 1980s after a local petition. It's really important to time your journey out here wisely because you've only got about 90 minutes each side of low tide to get here. Ideally, you want to be coming here when the tide is still going out. To get to the lighthouse, we drove down the beautiful Gower roads heading towards the picturesque village of Llamadoc. We took a right at Llamadoc Church and parked in a farmer's field with an honesty box, which made a lovely change from your usual car park. We started walking down the road through a little forest area and it wasn't long before we found ourselves on Whitford Sands. It took us over an hour to reach the lighthouse, but we were in no rush at all. Over the years in my Gower videos, I've touched upon many ghost stories and folklore tales that haunt this peninsula. Whitford Sands is no exception. It has a tale or two of its own. A story of an apparition galloping across Whitford Sands has been passed down over generations. All the way from Bruffton Beach to Whitford Sands, witnesses have heard the sound of hooves charging towards Whitford Lighthouse. The noise, so frightening, increasingly gets closer and louder before passing by. Some believe this to be the sound of a mammoth that would have occupied the Gao Peninsula around 20,000 years ago. Others say the noise is from an ancient battle which may have taken place here between the Celts and Roman soldiers. You can find out much more information about local ghost stories in Paranormal Gower. It's been so lovely to explore this part of North Gower. Whitford Lighthouse truly is a marvel to behold and a beacon of history.